Hello friends, welcome to my channel Hira Techies. In this video, let me explain how to upgrade Angular 16 application into Angular 17. For doing this one, I have created Angular 16 application. We can see in this package.json, all the libraries are in this version of 16. So here I have used the material UA and also the ngrx libraries, okay? For doing this upgrade, let me go to the Angular upgrade guide. So here our from version is 16 and we are converting this into Angular 17. So let me choose this advanced option and clicking show me how to update. So the first thing is it is expecting Node.js version is 18.13. So if you have the higher version, there is no problem. In case if you have the lower version, make sure you have to upgrade your Node.js. And the second thing is Angular 17 supports TypeScript version 5.2 or later so that we can upgrade and the next thing is we have to upgrade our uh, core libraries so before that make sure we have to upgrade our global Angular CLA for doing this one we have two options the first thing is we can directly upgrade I always recommending first uninstall the existing Angular CLA after that you have to execute this command it will install the latest version of Angular in your machine, okay? So already I have done all the steps. So we can execute this ng version. See, I am having this Angular CLI version 17.0.1 and the node version is 20.9, okay? So next we can upgrade our application. So currently application in this running mode, there is no issue, see? Next time executing this ng update command, it's collecting all the libraries. So we have these libraries like CDK, CLA, Angular Core, Angular Material, and NGRX Store. We have to upgrade everything one by one. So first let me take this ng update, Angular CDK. Okay, some of the packages are installed. After that, uh, due to this peer dependency, the installation gets failed, okay? So we can use this force command. So after this command, let me use this force. Okay, the installation completed. We can see the nodes. It is updated in this package.json. These are all the libraries. The first one is TypeScript. It is upgraded. So similarly, this Angular animation, CDK, common, compiler, and this one JS also upgraded. Okay. So the next thing is uh, we can upgrade the CLA. So let me copy this command. So let me use the force option. repository is not clean please commit or, or stash any changes before updating so let me check in this one so now we can execute the same command once it is completed we can upgrade this angular material because the core is already upgraded. Okay, the Angular CLA is upgraded and also it is included some changes. We can see in this angular.json. So instead of the browser target, it is changed into build target the same way. For this development and option everywhere it is changed, okay. So next we can upgrade this material UI. I mean this angular material. Okay, again we need to commit this one. Okay, the installation in progress. Okay, once this is completed, we have to upgrade the libraries for NGR related items. Okay, 
okay the angular material also upgraded so anyway let me commit the changes so let me copy this store so after that we can include all the items one by one okay Anyway, the store is already we have included. Okay, all the installation gets completed. Now let me execute this npm install. Okay, now all are up to date. So let me run this application and we can verify whether all the items are working fine. And our application also running. Okay, again we are getting the same response. Okay, invalid credentials and it is logged in. We can see this associate, customer, user and change role. Okay, all the functionalities are working fine and also we completely moved to this Angular sound in. We can see all the packages. We not just upgraded the direct angular packages. Additionally, we have upgraded this material UI and also this NGR related packages. And we have resolved the peer dependencies also. So now we are in the end of the video. Still, if you have any doubts or clarification, please post in the comment box. And also, please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching.